Right, what's I didn't even see who I got matched against. <laughs> it's Mulligan. <laughs> um, first time playing August. Yeah, right. Here, here's a tip for you. Um, never make blocks with the ogres. You want you want to uphill block with noblars. That's the uh, that's the best idea, Mull. Um, try to make sure. I'm trying to make sure your noblars get hit by block as much as possible. And uh, don't remove anybody with... Don't never block with ogres. Uh, that's the worst thing you can do. Um, try dodge... If, if, if your ogre starts turn-based, dodge him out. Um, you know, you want your ogres on the move all the time. And, uh, and yeah, get those blocks in with your noblars. That, that's my advice to you, Mull. Definitely. <laughs> right. Um, do I kick? Foul with ogres to protect them getting hit from rocks. Absolutely. Um, what do I do? Because ogres are awful on offense. So. Ooh, that's not that's such a bad. Oh, are we? Glorious. Thank you, Guy HD. Gage HD. I'm can't, pronouncing things isn't my strong suit. Um, <laughs> but thank you very much uh, for the sub. Thank you very much. Welcome to Team Fantastic. Wowee. Too fame for Jimmy. I do have a, I do have two fan factor. But um I don't know I don't know what the fuck I'm doing here. Thank you very much for the sub there. Um Thank you very very much. Oh yeah. This is a NAF team though, right? Yeah, still in still in the official NAF. Um <laughs> um, right. All oh, right. Oh wow, he's added the uh, he's added the uh, NAF logo and stuff. Glorious. <laughs> Stream did it. The message from Kurgo. Right, sort that out afterwards. Um, I don't know how long I'm going to play tonight because, on the one hand, it was pretty good playing till 3 a.m. last night because, <laughs> though I was still in agony, I was really fucking tired. So I did get some sleep last night. On the other hand, um. I was too loud, uh, which made me not so popular. Um, so I don't know what will happen with the late night streams. <laughs> the Malibu diet. Yeah, I know, right? I don't know what's going on. Anyway. <laughs> She's pretty rowdy. <laughs> pretty rowdy at night, I don't know why. <laughs> Malibu and kebabs. That's the dream, isn't it? <laughs> oh yeah! Oh god! Oh. And this is a pretty good roster for for ogres, to be fair, because they get a couple of rerolls and they get all the ogres. So it's a nice TV for ogres because they're really they're really fucking bad. Um, so yeah, so in in let, let's be realistic for advices for ogres. Um, yeah, obviously it's it's they're the same as they're the same as lizard men, except the saurus are unreliable and the skinks are absolutely fucking worthless. So, this, but the same kind of things apply in that you've got to, uh, you know, kind of control the pitch with the ogres and uh, 
you know, tie up the threats with the ogres and everything and all this kind of stuff. Um, for gobbos, oh, I don't know. I don't know what the gobbo advice would be. Because um, it's tough, isn't it? Protect your chainsaw. A lot of people would just, you know, don't don't use your chainsaw recklessly. Use him where, you know, good look at that. We can, I knew somebody had to get blissed. I guess I should have done rule of, rule of five. I guess I should have rule of five it. So if you've only blitzed a, a guard white or a thing. But I thought he's got dodge. But then he got blocked, didn't he? Shit. Fucking mull. Mull with the insta. Insta removal. But only a kill. Pat. I'll suit on him. Um, so, he's like Gage HD, maybe. I don't know what it is. Gage HD. Um, yeah, so Gobbles, I don't know. Yeah, protect your, protect your soul. Um, thank you. <laughs> and, uh, I don't know, just, just play good. I just like, you know, play ultra conservative with ogres and and goblins and flings I don't I don't throw throw people around if I don't have to you know I just try to just do safe moves first and really really play like you've got no rerolls and stuff you know um right should I go in 3 plus I don't hate it it's so so what what Muller's done here is either he doesn't know that um, that they've got this rule, or he doesn't care that they've got this rule. Whereby Titchy means they don't have proper tackle zones, so he's made a he's made a a cage, a tight cage that um, doesn't really do anything. <laughs> He's got diving tackle. So what I've done there is, I have forgotten diving tackle. So what he did was a fantastic play, and what I did was a really incredibly stupid play. And it was so what he did the double fake out there, didn't he? But um, right, I'm just going to mute myself. And All right. <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah, that was a tap. That was a subliminal tap from Muldrister. What a clever dingo. What a clever what a clever little bastard he is, isn't he, eh? Have you got any dip have you got any tips on ogres? Have you got any tips on ogres, Jimmy? Oh yeah, yeah, I'll just just get me thinking about that. Oh yeah, you need tips because you don't know that they've got Titchy. Oh he's got fucking diamond tackle. You little bastard. <laughs> Obviously I don't. I'm not being mean, you know, I'm not really calling the bastard. I like Muldripster like too. Aww. Yeah. A hard for me. Thank Oh, man. Oh, that was so bad from me, wasn't it? I could have just three dice to a little shitty thing with block and frenzy. Or mighty blow and frenzy and just didn't. Just <laughs> lost both ghouls on turn one. But I mean, he's got August, so it could still go all right. But he's going to three dice pom, isn't he? Which is uh, disappointing. Disappointing to say the least.
<laughs> get banged on. Does he use his? Does he use it or not? Didn't expect it, did he? And now he's got ten seconds out of a minute. That, that is such a crap rule, like crap interface on cyanide. Sort of decision that could be game deciding, and you can't expect somebody to spend a minute thinking because they maybe will roll a one in twenty-seven. Oh god, I can't believe how bad I was there. Glorious. Thank you very much, Stargoose9k. Subscribe from Twitch Prime. Welcome to Team Fantastic. And uh, thank you very much. Wowee. Beat me with ogres. <laughs> oh, shit. What a dirty dingo. Three players up in, th in three turns. Yeah, he's failed a couple to be honest. Four players out in three turns. But you know, one well, one was my fault because so I set up like an idiot. One was my fault because I forgot to have tackle like an idiot. And one was my fault because I went for a greedy frenzy trap just because I was trying to knock over a... not over a ogre with claw mighty blow because things had gone bad because I made the bad decisions. So, you know, if I had made bad decisions, I'd, I wouldn't have lost these three players. So, it's not it's not crazy dice or anything. It's just literally bad play being punished, which is which is what you want, isn't it? He's, I think he'll fail on these two dodges if he goes for them both.
Right. You go there to hit the ball. I could go here to hit the ball. Double GF, I think, could be a three dice on the ball. Could just ignore the ball, go for a three dice on there. I think I've got to go for the ball now, though, because it's so it's such a desperate situation, isn't it? So two dice into two dice is probably worth it, isn't it? GFI to get punched by Mighty Blow. Always a great play. Wow. <laughs> Mold Rectus. Comprehensively outplayed. Feels bad, man. I guess he's out of rerolls. Maybe I should have played more conservatively rather than going for the ball sack. Get him to roll dice. Always double one this dodge as well. It's possible. I mean, it's still just a three plus to three dice in, isn't it? A couple of times. Non ones. Diving tackle, I've just seen it. <laughs> I've just succumbed to it. At least, at least Mull can remove players for me. This is my last re-roll here with a split. Fucking hell. And if this is a push, then, <laughs> then if this is anything except a power, we will get him served. Good. Nothing. <laughs> Had to check to see if it was a claw bug then. 
minus three roll gone. One and nine. Perfect. Oh god. This is ugly. <laughs> what a game. I played shit. Play losing August because I played shit. But still, thanks. <laughs> thanks for all the subs. <laughs> um, normally I'm not so shit, honest. <laughs> I guess I haven't got it into the, uh, into the full on, you know, try hard mode maybe. But I should be in for uh, playing. Playing versus Mo. Thanks, Waitrix. Right, double GFI, the 3D. Because even with goblins, he's still. Not even goblins, ogres, he's still good, isn't he? So. I could have just not used re rolls and I'd, I'd have three tens to score. You are not bad, Jimmy. Just Mal is the best, so he makes you look bad. Nah, I've played shit. I've played shit. Um, <laughs> Mul's, Mul's really good, though. Mul's really good. And that's the thing. That's when I um, that's when I said to Guinness, who got really pissed off when I said, you know, with the dice he had, there was no way whoever it was could have won. It wasn't an insult to him, because... You know, if uh, if Mull gets gets the dice that he got with the Norse against us, no one no one can possibly beat him, can they? Um, if but if like Norse Dive had got those dice that the Norse had got, then and Mull had got the dice like if Mull had the undead and Nose Dive had the Norse and Nose Dive had the dice that Mull got, Mull could have still probably beaten him, wouldn't he? But um yeah, that Norse game was annoying, but I, I should have saved all my rerolls and then still been able to score in three. And just obviously forgot the diamond tackle. I mean, that was really bad. That was really bad not seeing the diamond tackle. Really bad exposing the ghoul to a bit on turn one. So I've, I've made some horrible plays. It's not as if Mull's just played like a god, which, you know, he could have done. But um, I think it's more me playing like an absolute shitter. Wow, that's pretty bad. Yeah, if, if Narin gets good dice against more people, they're just not going to win, are they? Sounds like a pretty bad yeah, it seems like a pretty bad deal for a pretty bad bug. Oh god, reroll that's handy, isn't it? And got sure hands. So could go down this side. I'm not really a fan of uh mull set up there to be honest. It's so bad when you just don't kill somebody as, uh, against uh, those little shits. Mm. 
right, so can I... Um, where can he go? Yeah, this is, this is relatively decent, isn't it? Delete a double skulls. Oh, that's a one dice. So. Oh my god, I thought it was two. That was a terrible play. Rewarded. Should I go one square forward there? Probably. Probably should have gone one forward. Shit. Three, four, five, six, seven. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Yeah, GFI. I like that he's got a strong arm for the uh, one turn. I think break tack would probably be more useful though most of the time. Wish we all still had catch. Base the Canoran threat. so crucial that bone here. Obviously it sucks to fail when they're on the ground. Because it's fucking you up the turn after as well, isn't it? I think it's a great great strip this uh old strip. Right, so but um Double GFR? Or what? He could go there. And he could double GFI. Could get surfed then though. Minus 3D surfed. Can I go back across the middle? Not really. Gonna go for a stupid play, seeing as that seems to be the theme of my play for this evening. <laughs> go for a dumb play. Just minus one wherever I go, so minus two is my vote for that. Oh man, 
caught lucky enough to score against Ogres. Holy shit. That was incredibly lucky. Minus to doing without block. Oh. <sighs> I got away with that. Holy shit. Something like this, I guess. Guess make and make blocks before the toss is worth it, isn't it? Didn't even need the reroll. Unbelievable. Staying naftastic's pretty great, isn't it? Because it's nearly fantastic. It's just a little bit. It's a little bit clever, that, isn't it? Staying naftastic. Because it's nearly fantastic. Oh god, is my just a little bit. My fucking voice has gone. No one said. Oh, microphone's a bit fucked up. Like that. <laughs> Fair enough, right? So. Oh, Jim Deep. It's still bad. Yeah, I actually read Jim Deep and I just didn't get it. Get to do anything. Two plus to one dice him, or two plus to yeah. Okay, go for this first. Oh baby, one hit from the claw. Not even mighty blow. Got him. Pretty, pretty fucking lucky. Reroll, come on. Yes, he made the pick up. Get it, Snotling.
That's awesome. What a super zombie. Worked out amazing scoring a scoring a turn early. Oh, he's setting up. It's my reception. Oh. Three six. So he's still got eleven, but crucially down an ogre. Wolves are a bit horrible for all this because obviously your biggest strength <laughs> is ogres and getting losing them the claw is fucking bollocks, isn't it? Alright. We've got Guard one's here. He can block the guard one. He can block the other guard one. And then... Something can happen. That's what I'm going to go with after that. Good werewolves. Right. Get these fucking guard guys away. I guess I have to follow now. But I can't. Mm, clever, clever dingo, isn't he? All that more. Mully D. Oh, and they've got sidestep. Doesn't do much good though. He could go in and he could blitz. And he gets a block on a snot. Let's see if they fix the bug. They have unbelievable gear. Can he base the ball? No. No idea.
can he can base the ball. I don't have block. Shit. Dirty dingo, killed by a snotling. <laughs> Fuck about. Oh man. You can't ignore the levels, unfortunately, Tony. So yeah, it's a bit... I guess just make a new team. Because... <laughs> Because in for I mean, you know, we'll be restarting as soon as as soon as we can. Like as soon as it's fixed, we'll just have to restart, I guess. So Unfortunately your reign at the at the King of the as the King of the Hill will be kind of short lived, I guess. I'm sorry, but you know, it's, we're just gonna have to restart, aren't we? Because this is you know, you can't have people with plus fan factor and everything. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I wish it. I wish it weren't, weren't like this. But it is like this. And there's not a lot we can do, is there? Yeah, you can one dice us if we're going. Harder for me one dice us. That saves him, I guess. He wants to go here so that it's pretty hard to one dice him now. One dice is for days, got to do it, haven't you, against uh, ogres? Like a half dice ogres, I don't mind half dicing an ogre if I've got to, which is why I quite like Stanford. Hopefully we'll fix it pretty soon. And then yeah, just restart it. It's just a shame because you know that was the only thing in Legendary Edition I was actually excited for. <laughs> Having Rez and NF official ladder. And now it's like Unbelievable. Yeah, but after it worked in the beta, it's crazy, isn't it? Could get him. Take a lot of work though. Maybe better just to hit a snotling. Three dice. Three, four, five. Yeah, maybe. Yeah, okay. Yeah, 
He's got a guard anyway, so even if he stayed in contact, it's still two dice incoming. God, I hope I can get there. Yeah. Eye cage is, is good, isn't it, against Snotlings? Because it means all they can do is minus, minus three dice block you. Makes them not, not the most frightening skinks in the world. Of course not. <sighs> all I needed was a push. <laughs> Get a ball down. Bleh. Yeah, although it's a shame that people are getting skills and uh, levels. What can you do? Not a lot. Maybe I should re-roll that block here. Yeah. Oh, re-roll down. In some kind of, some kind of formation, maybe. versus not only holy shit. I guess the snotlings are too far away now. This is a two dice, isn't it? I guess I can kind of just uh, make a potato play against ogres. This has been horrific. Way more frightening than it should have been. So props to Mo. Way, way closer than it should have been. And could he could still win or tie, couldn't he? It's not over. Finally stand firm doing something. Oh, 
Oh, good guy, Shawnee, streaming enough official. Glorious. Glorious. I think the enough official would be a great format, to be honest. Wow, getting two dice by a snot. Well, no blow. isn't it is all is the only play Yeah, Necrostomus is a pretty good team, yeah. Um, but I made a meal of beating Ogres. <laughs> um, though, you know, I mean, I played... I made some horrible misplays. Some horrible, horrible misplays. I mean, no matter how good the Ogre coach is, Ogres should not have a chance in this game. So it's, it's entirely, it was entirely down to me making bad plays, I think. More than more than more making good ones. I think I made some horrible, horrible plays. But luckily, luckily for me, Ogre's just being so fucking bad has made up for it more or less. Should have made up for it anyway. Yeah, true. Yeah, it's, it, they are. They really do benefit, especially with this one at tier two. But um, but yeah, like stuff like humans, even and orcs, and they're all kind of great out of the box, aren't they? Because they start with the block and stuff. Whereas necro start with two block. And they want to be blitzing with the werewolves. <laughs> and they want to be skinning with the flesh golems. So they really are a dodgy starting team. Lizards are really good getting six boxaurus. However, however, <laughs> the problem that they face is the best team starts off with two war dancers, one with tackle and one with strip ball. <laughs> <laughs> so lizards basically stomp everything that isn't isn't woodies and then don't like fighting woodies or dark elves dark elves get like six blodge so they don't really like dark elves or wood elves but pretty much everything else they smash yeah they smash a lot of things lizards with six block or Five block and one guard is a is quite a common build. Ah, three D. Dudley Death Drop. I always just go for a one dive with a knob. Oh yeah, because I've got guard. I wonder why I made the dodge and so just you know blocking this is. Is weird with Anji. I'm not surprised though, like, because you know, they'll still be discovering the uh, the vampire bugs months down the line. You know, they're, they're, 
Vamps were always going to be bug ridden. A bug ridden mess. There's, there's no two ways about it. Um, if I get rid of all his missiles, I'll be safe. Turn, so might as well re-roll it. Eh? Go for the greed. <laughs> you had me going there, plus you for me though. Two vampires is the worst. There's no argument you can make behind it, is there? I don't think. Oh, he had to save his reroll for the yellow. One turn, didn't he? I just realized. I wondered a few times why he didn't reroll things. And obviously, uh, that's it. Yeah, but. Honestly, we're done to you. I think there's there's still vampire bugs on Fumble. And you know, if one guy working for free in his spare time can't fix vampire bugs, Cyanide have got no fucking chance of fixing <laughs> fixing <laughs> bloodless bugs. Well, yes. I mean, if he could have, if he could have given them more block, he would have done. Um, I mean that's that's what that's why I think it would be all right to have. Let them get block. Blocks just the best skill in the game, isn't it? To be fair, to be fair, even though even though guards unbelievable, and mighty blows powerful, and piling ones powerful, and claws powerful, and dodge is really really fucking good. Block's still the best game, isn't it? Did I just say block's the best game? Best skill in the game. You just dropped half the sentence. But, uh, there you go. GG, whatever happens. Fucking made a fucking fire of it, didn't he? That was, that was pretty close. And it could still be a 2 2. Um. Um no. Genuinely I would like to have seen him try. I would like to have seen him try and fail, but I would have still like to have seen him try. <laughs> um Is there a position on which block is not high priority? Um Yeah. To be fair, wrestle on some things. Like, you know, wrestle well, obviously, Brett blockers start with wrestle, but like you know, uh, good runners are often take wrestle, and uh, you know, elf catches, and stuff like that. A lot. Witch elves. Some people called Sam Davies like taking wrestle on witch elves, but um, yeah, mostly blocks. Blocks just the best, isn't it? The fact that it knocks over people without it, but then wrestle wrestle for people as well. To be fair, but still blocks the best. Wow. A 2-1 grind against the worst team in the game. <laughs> GG, Mo. You, you played very well, of course. Um, I think I think I played really bad, though. Missing the diving tackle and setting up badly. And, you know, I think... I think it was, I made some very poor plays, but... Uh, GG. I was just saved by Ogres being shit, wasn't I?
Oh, and then I get it. So on the reroll, you get it. And got the money as well. See there, SPP, none. See, so it's, it's meant to not work. It's really fucking meant to not work. Forty-two, ten, eighty-one. I mean, that's actually eighty-one's okay, isn't it? Piling on, even though it was more with the pylons. But the the two dice blocks are just amazing now. Well, not the two dice blocks. The blocks are just amazing. And now I've got fifty k. Because I re-rolled it. Oh, that's that's really bad, isn't it? That's really bad that you can re-roll it and get money. And it's really bad that throughout the game it said there was no skills. It said there was no SPPs, but now this ghoul's on 9, the wolves on 11, the MVP's counted now, and the fan factor's gone up. And it's just... It's a bit of a fuck-up, isn't it? I can't believe that it worked... It worked fine as well in in the normal in the beta. It actually worked fine, and now that now that it's out, it's fucked up. <laughs>